What's going on everybody? This is Darren from Affordable Shoe Review. Here to review some streetwear for your friends and you. Before we get into this video guys, if you are new here, please go like, subscribe, and comment. Especially like. Uh, the likes on my videos, uh, I would love to see those numbers go up a little bit because that really helps with the YouTube algorithm and getting my videos out there for other people to see. So please make sure you like this video. I appreciate you very much. Now let's get into all of my new era caps as well as sneakers that i think that my new era caps match very well with so the reason i'm making this video guys is because in multiple videos i have had people ask me about my hats uh, most recently i had somebody ask me about this hat right here um, i was wearing this in one of my videos i wear a lot of weirder hats uh, they're definitely not things that you see very often because they come from mostly minor league baseball teams um, and I just really like the logos on a lot of minor league baseball teams. It's not that I'm a fan of these teams, but I just really dig the logos and the hat styles for all of these minor league teams. So I'm going to go into all of my caps, my, my rotation of hats, and then also some sneakers that I think match very well with these hats. So if you guys ever needed some inspiration for a fit, hopefully you can take it from this video. So let's go ahead and get into it. All right, guys. So first is the hat that I was actually wearing. This hat is from the Hillsboro Hops. Um, I'll flash that up on the screen for you so you guys can see it. But this was part of their Latin American Heritage Night. And uh, you can see that right there with all the bright colors, the blue and the teal, as well as the pink inside of that wolf. Um, this is a dope hat. I love this hat. Um, but I have right here the Joe Fresh Goods and New Balance 993. Uh, and this is just a really, really awesome sneaker. But I definitely think that this matches very well with this teal. And then this darker teal here, I think this is a really dope touch and it also matches really well with my shirt. So I definitely think that this would be a dope fit if I threw these on feet, had this hat, just a really cool uh, fit right here. But I really do love this hat, it's pretty awesome. So my next hat, I don't really have a sneaker for because you're not gonna find many things that match this. If you guys know, think of one, uh, put it down in the comments below. But this is the Lehigh, Lehigh Valley Iron Pigs. This was from their uh, Latin American Heritage Night with the tree frog or the like poison dart frog with that bright blue and pink. I thought this was a super dope hat. I don't know if you guys can see that, try to get the focus there, but a very, very cool hat. Um, I was really happy to grab this one, super dope. Um, yes, I do have a size eight head. I know I've got a massive head, but uh, somebody was in, in the comments was gonna mention that I'm sure, but really dope hat here. But let me know down in the uh, comments if you could think of any sneakers to match this one. So next up, I have a all brown Montreal Expos hat. I was a huge Expos fan growing up. They became the Washington Nationals. So now I am a Washington Nationals fan, but I really dig this hat with that brown Montreal Expos logo. And I definitely think this one fits very well with my vintage pecan and sail dunks. Uh, just a really cool fit when I throw these two together. I've done it several times. Um, and then, you know, usually a white shirt and tan bottoms or whatever it is but definitely love throwing these two together. I think this is a great hat as well. It's got that, uh, that Expos writing on the side with their stadium. Obviously they're not a team anymore, but since they became my favorite team, I was able to grab this hat and I love it. So really cool combo here between the vintage dunks and then this Montreal Expos hat. So another one that I think goes really well is going to be the Gwinnett Stripers. This is an Atlanta Braves minor league team. Um, and I hate the Braves, but once again, I love the minor league logos. I have, I'm a huge fisherman, so I love the fish on this, uh, this cap in particular. And I have had people ask about this cap in my videos. And then I have my Nike ISPA Flow 2020s. And I think that these two go very, very well. I think that pale green from the fish goes very well with the pale green on this sneaker. I think these match extremely well. Just a really dope combo right here whenever I throw a fit together. So. Cool shoe, really awesome shoe, but also a great hat. Um, this is probably my favorite hat out of all the ones that I have looking at them. Probably my favorite hat, one that I've worn the most often. Um, just a great, great hat. So really cool cap if you guys were interested in this one. All right, guys, moving on to another one that I think is just, it would make a dope fit. I don't know that I'll ever wear my Kobe 6 Pro Tour Grinches, but a really dope fit here. This is the Richmond Flying Squirrels. I am from Virginia, so Richmond is kind of my local minor league baseball team. Um, and this is once again from their Latin American Heritage Night. So it's got those bright neon colors in that blue, but that bright neon green definitely matches very well with these Kobe Grinches. 
So I definitely think this would be a really dope hat to wear or rock with your Kobe Grinches if you had them. So if you have a pair of these, I would recommend going and grabbing this hat because that nice lime neon green definitely goes very, very well with your Grinches here. Such a cool fit to throw together. If you are more than willing to rock your Kobe's, uh, I recommend this hat. This is from the Richmond Flying Squirrels. Really, really dope hat. Obviously a dope sneaker. Super cool. So I don't know that I have a hat and shoe to show you guys that fit more perfectly than this one. This is my Miami Dolphins hat. I'm a huge Miami Dolphins fan, um, but they came out with a vintage Pro Bowl line this year. So this is from the 1994 Pro Bowl, but you'll see that like gold and red patterning for that vintage Dolphins logo. And I definitely think that that matches very well with the LeBron Fairfax. This is the LeBron 7 Fairfax, my apologies but I don't think that I have any sneakers that match quite as well as these do. So whatever fit you would like to throw on, I think this cap and this shoe just match each other almost to a T with the black, the gold, and the red. Just a really cool fit option right here if you had the LeBron 7 Fairfax and you were able to grab any of this 1994 vintage Pro Bowl line. Doesn't matter the team, they came out with a line of this coloration for every NFL team. I just happened to like the Dolphins, so I was able to grab this hat right here. All right, guys, next up, we have our Charleston Boiled Peanuts. Yes, the Charleston Boiled Peanuts. That's actually a minor league team, um, or at least it used to be. Uh, I think they changed the name. But the Charleston Boiled Peanuts, I know this was a limited hat, and you can see right there with that peanut coloration on the brim, just such a cool logo. Um, I love this hat as well, so all the tans and then the dark forest greens. Uh, really nice hat. And I think that this goes pretty well with my Union LA Jordan 2 Rattan colorway. Um, I, I like this fit right here, this fit option. Um, throwing on some olive pants or something like that, or even burnt orange pants to go with the orange in this sneaker. Uh, but I definitely think that this is a really cool option as well. If you are looking for something to match your uh, Rattan Union 2s, I like this one right here. This is the Charleston Boiled Peanuts. Now the next two don't match like to a T, but they are things that I like wearing together. So this is my Tom Sachs general purpose shoe in the dark sulfur colorway. And this is, I don't even know how to pronounce the name, Beloit, Beloit, maybe B-E-L-O-I-T, the Beloit Skycarp, Skycarp, I think that's it. Uh, this is a brand new minor league team that actually came out last year. Um, they've, they've played their inaugural season last year, but I love the orange hits on this Tom Sachs matching with the orange hits on the uh the canadian goose it looks like uh that's the logo for the sky carp so i really think that those match and i love those pops so really depending on what else you would throw on your fit but i definitely think that this hat and this shoe uh, they pop together with those orange subtle hits uh, i like those a lot so really really cool uh this is the beloit scar sky carp i just can't even say their name beloit sky carp that's it uh right here um just a really really cool hat and a great logo all right, guys, and the last one I had for you was the Clearwater Threshers. You can see right here, the Threshers are a type of shark, a Thresher shark, and you can see the shark here chasing the baseball. This was from their July 4th, or July 4th line, so you'll see obviously the American flag with the stripes and the dark blue and the stars and the red here. Uh, I definitely love wearing this uh, hat in particular with my Lost at Sea Nike SB Dunk Highs. The red matches that Atlas pop right there. I have the dark blue and the white to go with the dark blue and the white. Now, obviously the blues don't match exactly, but I do love wearing this sneaker with a red, white, and blue sneaker. So very, very cool. Um, definitely dig this hat. If you guys haven't seen me, I, I actually just got this in um, a couple weeks ago, so I haven't worn it in a video yet, but definitely will coming soon. Uh, don't worry, but I will be wearing this one quite a bit because I think it's just an awesome logo. And I definitely love that American flag background for the Clearwater Threshers right here. And then obviously the shoe to go with it. Pretty cool, pretty cool. So very excited about this hat in general. All right, guys. So I appreciate you very much for tuning into this video. Hopefully you found it informative or at least found some, some cool hat options. Uh, I would recommend checking out Minor League Baseball's shop, looking through all the teams because you can find some crazy awesome hats and logos 
Um, if I had more money, I would have bought a ton more hats than the ones that I have now. But I've got a lot of hats that I think are really dope, some really cool logos. So anyway, please stay safe, stay blessed. Thanks for tuning in for a few minutes. We'll see you soon and peace out.